made it to Como. We are in Italy. I am, we're so impressed with this Airbnb. It is so big and we got such a like a deal on it too. I'll give you a little bit of a tour, but it's beautiful. When you walk in, you have this great large living room, which looks amazing. Also, you have a Fendi print over there, which is kind of iconic. Um, lots of space over here. So all the bedrooms are down that way. And then we have this amazing balcony, like that connects. There's Jen. Oh, it comes complete with Jayla. Comes Luz. complete with Jayla Luz. Yes, look at this view. You see the mountains over there, the streets. Like, look at that. Like, I'm thinking morning coffee out here for sure. Rooms are also very large. We have a queen size bed in here, with all, which also connects to the balcony out there. And we have two bathrooms with two showers. The girls are using them now. And then we have this king size room as well. And I don't have a balcony here because I'm sharing this with Zoe, but we do have a nice window and a view. These are the fits for day one in Como. Yay! You guys, can you not get it's. Oh, What's happening? I don't know how to wear the door. Be nice. It's day one of Lake Como. We're actually in Como. And we got ready, we rallied, and now we're gonna try to explore the town and get food and apple spritzes and pizzas and pastas. And aperitivos. Yes, on the hunt. Got Cafe Duo. Oh my God, you started vlogging before me. <laughs> Here's Lene. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I'll be a trip if I do not stop and get that pizza. I'm gonna test this out. I got my Aperol. Day 507 of me right. asking Stephen to open this up for me. Oh, no, wait, my hands are like... I also don't want to bend my rings. My thin yeah. rings are really delicate. I have no idea. Bend. I have never used Oh my god. Oh, my eyes ready. Let's see, this is the first pizza in Italy. I hate it. I really am. <laughs> what do you think about the first meals in Italy? You know, my first meal was an Aperol spritz and I really enjoyed and it. And that was And then I followed satisfying. it up with a Negroni, also delicious. Okay, work. I literally didn't order food. <laughs> I only Lindsay's food. lying, she ordered a like whole pig. I only drank and had a slice of Steven's pizza. And I'm she's reporting food poisoning. <laughs> but I was like, no. No. Burrata, 10 out of 10. That, 4 out of 10. Okay. A little stressed. So we wrapped up dinner, or like a snack, I guess you could say. I'm basically copying Lindsay's vlog, so I'm gonna link her vlog below so you can just look <laughs> at the same content. But I, I thought the pizza, mm, it was okay. It wasn't the best. So the hunt continues for good pizza. Um, and Lindsay ate like the most. She had like a huge, they, they roasted a pig for her. Like, it was crazy. Um, but we're never gonna get drinks, cappuccinos, we're gonna go to a different place. Oh. You're a little bit burnt here. I know. We are now looking for a rooftop bar because Lindsay loves rooftop bars. I'm a whore for rooftops. <laughs> That's true. And we think we found the one that we're gonna go to. And we are excited. Can Jen see us? Yeah. yeah. It is day two in Lake Como. Um, I am woke up this morning, got some work done, which I feel really good about, and I'm gonna get some coffee. And then we actually are gonna go to Bellagio today and see that area, because apparently that's like the beautiful, beautiful luxury spot. But um, yeah, so day two looking good. Um, what's not looking good is that it's supposed to be 38 degrees today and I do not have that kind of clothes, which basically means nothing because I don't have anything that would sustain that heat. I have like little like, button ups, little cute outfits and they all are not that heat resistant. So I might die of heat, stroke and sweat. So just relax. Getting ready to go to Bellagio. Look at the girls' rock and floral dresses. Look at Lene. Look at Zari. What hair looks like in the back? I'm wearing just like a white sort of linen top, not really linen, and then um, a mesh sort of top. I died of heat yesterday. I felt like I had heat stroke, so hopefully today feels a lot better. Um, and we'll go from there.
Exciting. So we just know I'm obsessed with her outfit. Look at this big old peach. Okay, we're in line. I'm complaining because it's hot. <laughs> and it's like there's no, absolutely no wind. Zero wind. Yeah, look how long the line is. And so Zoe got a nice coffee. What they give you, Zoe? Uh, they give me a hot little espresso, and I wanted ice and a chocolate or no, Nutella for someone. Perfect. So I'm gonna make a break. Um, I'm also the one that is like dying of heat, which is really unusual. I feel like I'm okay to eat. Um, but anyways, now we're at this restaurant. We're sitting indoors, and we're waiting for our boat ride. And I got a nice coffee. I don't like like smoke. Oh, no. Not an iced coffee, it's an iced cappuccino. Like, like, and it's really good. If you can follow my TikTok saga on looking for iced coffees, it's pretty good. Oh my god, look how wet I look. Oh, we're sweating. Look at Lindsay. Apparently she doesn't sweat. We're on the, bo we're on the boat, and now we're actually... Um, Note to self, book this in advance. If you're watching, don't, don't do this to yourself. How do you guys feel? I'm just amazing. I'm blowing. You actually are? It's too much. Made it to Bellagio. We've been here now for a minute. Um, we're dying from literal heat. It is so hot. Nothing you wear is acceptable. And Lindsay just ran into a girl from her hometown, which is actually kind of funny. The world is small. And now we're trying to find food, which is um, not hard to find. It's just, there's, it's just so hot and there's, it's actually very busy in Bellagio. So um, lots of crowds, lots of people waiting to eat. Um, yeah, so we're on the hunt for that. But so far, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful city. Like it's absolutely stunning. Yummy stuff. I obviously got a pizza and I got Aperol spritz. And Lynn's got more wine. And she got a pasta. Take a bite, Lynn. I'm waiting for a spoon. Ready? I'll see the first first um, impressions. Bite in real life. You like that? Zoe? Garden. It's absolutely beautiful. This amazing view. I don't know how much it's gonna see because it's super bright out, but it's gorgeous. First impressions. We love the garden. Zoe, what did you say? The most beautiful place I've ever been. The most beautiful place she's ever been. I think it would be a gorgeous venue, like for a wedding. Like obviously, it is so gorgeous. The view. Like there's a home on the uh, the property here. Jen, what do you think? I love it. It's a win, and also only eight euros to get in, so pretty reasonable. And you have the whole you can use uh, your time as long as you want. Bless you. We wrapped at the garden, and it's so hot. I don't think you guys can actually see. I mean, my skin is a little wet, but it's so hot. I don't know why it just hit us now more than ever, but it was just like 38 degrees. It is. I don't know, and I'm waiting to get water. We're all kind of delirious. We all wore the wrong clothes. So now we're heading back on the ferry and probably, yeah, we actually have to head back now. We made it on a boat, who's happy? Lynn, Jen. Yeah, so I'm SPF. Steven just bitched for 45 minutes, but we're all happy. <laughs> It's been a very long and hot day in Como and Bellagio, so we are ready to like pack it in for the night. Maybe go get a small bite or small drink, but we all need like very cold showers and to rest. Right, John? <laughs> We're gonna make it. It is our last day, day three in Como, and. Kind of a rest day, relaxing. Lindsay's catching up at work. 
or just having coffee leisurely, and we're gonna see if we can kind of find something to do, but keep it chill, which is nice. Right now I'm having a lovely cappuccino and a croissant because I cannot find healthy food here, but I'm also not really looking, and I'm going for the easiest thing, which is croissants. There's my croissant, my chocolate croissant, and my cappuccino, and then that is uh, Jen, also cappuccino. Mm, can't wait. She is obsessed with us. She's following me everywhere. She, <laughs> she's had enough of my shit. <laughs> we literally decided to get vegan food in Italy. Um, and it looks so freaking good. We also got some fresh juices as well, which are delicious. And we just really wanted health. We wanted a lot of nutrients, so this looks good. So we just wrapped up at Vagami's, and it was actually so good. We were so surprised. Not actually surprised, we walked in and we like knew it was gonna be good, but it was really good, because we found that it's like, probably like not, you come to Italy, you're not supposed to have vegan food, but it was really good. So we support it, we recommend it. I'll put it down in the description below if you guys are ever in Como and do wanna try some good vegan food. Jen, did you like it? I loved it. I feel like the food was very cool, flavorful, filling, <laughs> and the price point was really good. Yeah, it was cheap, it was the whole 12, thing. 12.50 euro for, each for an person. entire meal, and I'm stuffed. Yeah. Plus a fresh juice. And we got a fresh juice. Fresh. It's our last night in Como, and uh, Zoe and Lindsay found a really great Italian place for pasta, so we're gonna do that tonight. And I'm very excited because we were looking for authentic, we were looking for the best, and this they stumbled across, and it's supposed to be really, really good, so. Fingers crossed, it's gonna live up to the hype. It's hard to see the fit. Um, it's a green polo, which I actually got from Club Monaco. And then I got some gray linen pants, which I also think uh, are from Club Monaco. And this is the fit for tonight. Yes. I'm actually trying to find Rhino. a pasta place. Oh, oh, Reno, I thought it was called, right? Reno? Reno, Reno. Move to the pasta place. <laughs> Live updates. <laughs> Live updates. It's raining. Broadway. It's also raining, which is crazy because it's been so hot here. But now it's raining, you think it'd be refreshing. It's just still hot. It's just yeah. Humid summer. Humid girl summer. Ready for pasta? <laughs> Born ready. I'm a nona. Yeah. What are you really excited for? Say it. Something truffle. Now you're looking for a little bit of sausage. Yeah, she wants a <laughs> sausage. None of us have been successful in our dating. Oh my God, I burped. <laughs> There's been no guys. Not the one, what do you think? What does that mean? <laughs> we are done in Como. We had such a good couple of days here and it was good, the food was good. The weather was a little bit too hot, I will say. I did not appreciate that, but it was beautiful. And now we're heading to Milan, so this will be a whole new vlog in Milan. Bye guys. <laughs>